So we're sitting here at Cobblestone Farms. We are a nonprofit hunger relief organization. We operate on 25 acres in West Fayetteville. Uh, we grow organic style produce and raise pasture livestock. We like to say uh, we want to do what we do best and we want to outsource the rest. Um, so we want to grow the food. Um, we don't have the capacity or know-how or you know, anything else we would need to actually distribute it. So we grow the food and NW Food Bank or Seeds That Feed or sometimes some other partners, they come out and they pick it up. And then they're the ones that uh, get it to the, the folks that, that need it. Our partners are incredibly important to what we do. We literally could not do what we do without our partners. 90% of our funding is through charitable donations. Um, we have families and individuals who invest, local companies, national companies, foundations who have invested in us for years. Um, but those dollars, it's not just about the dollars. I want to get people's dollars invested in our community to lead their hearts to be more invested in our community. We could produce a million pounds of food a year, and while yes, that would make a lot of people's lives different, we're not gonna change our community by ourselves. We want the young family, the retired couple, the college student to realize the reality of hunger. Um, that you know, one in five kiddos in Northwest Arkansas have a lot of anxiety about what their next meal is gonna come from. If everybody viewed their house in their own space, like most of us view our community, it would be, it would be pretty terrible. Oh, that tree fell in my yard, but that's not my responsibility. That's, that's how we treat our community. Oh, well, you know, they're underserved kids in our community. That's not my responsibility. But in reality, our community is your front yard, um, and it's only going to get better if we get involved. We, we want to have members of our community out here because we're not just working for today. Um, we're, we're working for a hope for tomorrow. I believe that we, and when I say we, I don't mean cobblestone or our board members or our volunteers. I believe we as a community have a great opportunity to change what our food system looks like, both from how the food is produced and what access to that food is like. I would love to see um, other communities replicate this. Um, I, I am a big, big fan of collaboration. I would, there's a proverb I like, you know, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go together. Um, I would be happy to if there was a Jonesboro, a Little Rock. So that gives me a lot of hope. Um, if we were up here trying to do this by ourselves, and if there were, if there was no one else doing this, I would be terrified. But the fact that there are so many hearts and minds pushing towards a day where all community members have access to fresh, nutrient dense foods produced through sustainable methods. Um, it gives me the energy I need to keep going forward.